hello friends in this video we are going to see how to submit a document to the repository with embargo now let me add one document to the repository and uh, then we will see the effect of embargo so first you have to log in with your id and password once you log in with your id and password you will be getting the submission page just click on start new submission and then choose your collection where you want to add the document so i choose the e newsletter and click on next button fill up all the metadata field so let me fill up the detail here for example i add e newsletter monthly e newsletter and uh, volume number 1 issue number 2 and then i take the date of issue then publisher and all the relevant fields i am filling here so it can be given in this way and now what is this so let me take uh, this is an article and click on next button so here it is asking you give some keywords so i am giving if i want to give any more so i can give by adding the subject keyword here and if you have to write any abstract about this item who has is sponsored or the little description so you can use the html tags also here and then click on next button when you click on next button it will take you to the uploading a file window and just open the window or select the file which you want to upload into the repository so i will go and choose the file and then i'll upload in the repository so let me choose the file first and then i'll show you how it works so i am taking the number 2 monthly e newsletter so by now i have uh, uploaded one file now this is the file which i have uploaded and uh, i have given that file description now click on next button so when you click on next button it will take you to the next page which will look like this and you can notice here that volume 1 number two and you will find one extra button on this page that is the access setting so just click on this button and it will show you the another window where you can notice that there is a text embargo date and here you can select the date up to what date my document should not be visible to the users so for example i take 31st of december 2017 and you can mention the region also sometimes it happens that you have submitted the document to the publisher so after submission or publication of your article in journal or anywhere you want that it should be visible here otherwise what will happen it will be tracked in the plagiarism software and uh, that may invite trouble so in that case you can that's why you are giving a uh, means embargo here that date that before this date it should not be visible to the end user so you can write the region here and then click on save so you have set the date 
for this document that before that date it, it will not be seen by any user now click on next and rest of the procedure is same you can notice here access is allowed from 31st of December 2017 means that before that nobody will be able to download or see the content or file now just click on next and uh, grant the license so when you grant the license it gets submitted to the collection and now it is ready for the search L let me log out since I am an administrator so if I search it may browse and show me the full content let me search as a normal user first let us see whether it is available in the repository or not yes we can see here the author Satyam Tripathi and all the details are given the two files we can find inside and now I am going to search the librarian guide so when I search the librarian guide I will get two files here you can see I am getting two files now let open this and when we open this what information we get that is important yes it is showing the metadata and also you can see that it is showing the file detail but see and observe whether it is allowing you to download the file perhaps not why because it is embargoed and it is asking to log in with your user ID and password it means it is accessible but with the permission of the submitter with ID and password so you can see that you can see only the metadata but you cannot download or see the content of file there is another option request a copy so you can click on this and you can send a request to the uh, uh, means uh, owner of the document and when you send the, the means request to owner it will go and based on the policy the owner can send you the document so in this way we can enable one file with embargo feature in order to restrict the access till particular time or date so I hope I have been able to make you understand how to submit the document to repository with embargo date with a particular date or time so thanks for watching this video keep watching librarian guide to get more videos on YouTube thank you very much